Hey guys, welcome to the shop. This is Jim. I've got a question for guys with the G0704 or the G0759, and that's what this is. That's just uh, the same mill, but it comes with the DRO. My question is about the spindle. I kind of noticed early on, uh, and it has never given me a problem, but I kind of like to take care of it enough so that it'll just keep working for me and uh, I don't want to make it a problem. But it gets, uh, it gets warm in here. If I run it quite a bit and I'm working it kind of hard, you'll feel it warming up in here, which I assume has got to be the bearings. And I don't know. I looked in the manual and I don't see it. Uh, I don't under, I, I'm missing it. If I'm looking at it, I'm not seeing it. But I don't know what the bearings are in here. I'm assuming that they're sealed. There's no way to oil them. There's no ball oilers or anything else on the sides of that. There's no way through the top to oil it. Um, you've got the, the the quarter, the four-sided top of that screw there that you hold with a small wrench and then you put the you put the pin in here to uh, change and remove collets and end mills and cutters. Uh, but uh, this part of it, if you hold the, the shaft from the bottom, uh, you can turn this off, this, this piece right here. Sorry about that. You can turn that part off. And I would have guessed that's uh, setting the preload on the bearings. So it's, it's squeezing squeezing the top bearing into the race or whatever and the bottom bearing up from the bottom and uh, whatever. But uh, so you guys that probably have done the CNC conversion on this have probably torn that all apart and uh, know exactly what's going on in there. But I'm wondering if there is uh, some way I can get in there to oil the bearings. I know this uh, up here is how you get in there to grease the gears, which I've done occasionally and I don't have a problem with that and I've never broken gears and any of that. But uh, just wondering if there's something something I should be checking here as far as the tension. I don't see a reference on how tight this should be. Whether you over tighten that, it would put too much pressure on those bearings. And if there's a way to get in there to oil those or grease them. So if anybody knows, uh, leave me a comment. Uh, I'll put a link, a video link, if you've got a video about uh, find a video you know where they've torn it down and uh, done anything in there. It's something to worry about. I mean, it doesn't it doesn't get so hot it would burn you, but you can definitely feel that if you run it for a while that it's warming up right in that area, which has got to be where the bearings are at. So, uh, just curious, uh, wanting to try to protect my investment a little bit if I can. Um, been working good for me. I still like it. I've had it a couple of years now, and uh, don't want to don't want to break it. So uh, that's where I'm at. See you next time.